All right, guys, welcome back. I know that at the end of the last episode, I told you all that we would take down the boss, you know, Godric. But I've kind of had a change of, uh, you know, thinking. I want to get this build going sooner rather than later. And, you know, we need a few stats. So I made a video showing how you should spend your first hour in Elden Ring. And essentially... It is just beelining over here to Caleb and taking down the Elder Dragon because you get 50,000 uh, runes, I about said souls, 50,000 runes for taking down the Elder Dragon. Then you get another, you know, 24,000 or so for two other dragons dying as it dies. So, yeah, I think we're going to go do that because I think at this point, you know, 70,000 runes would be massive. And I'm actually, let's see if I have one inventory... Yeah, right here. Uh, golden pickled foul foot. So we'll pop this if we can't get, you know, close to 100,000 runes. And that will set our character on the right track. Because I want to get the moon veil. I want to put this build together. I want to get it going. It's going to be tons of fun. And I'm just ready. So with that being said, let's make our way over. So let's go here. I know there's a uh, there's a grace right over here. We'll go get the map piece. Hello, puppy. Lightning grease. All right, let's grab this grace right here. We'll run over here and grab this. Okay, so let me we want to head in that direction. We want to get the map piece. I'm pretty sure there's a grace right next to that. So we'll just make our way over this this way. Like I said, you know, I do have a video on this. You know, I mean, if there's an easy mode in Elden Ring, this is this is it. I mean, I'm a little further. It won't help me out as much as it would have, you know, me doing it in my first hour. Because if I done the math right, even if I use a uh, the golden pickled foul foot and I get 100,000 runes, I think that's still only about 12 levels where early game it's like 25 levels. But nonetheless, it's still a uh, good idea. Let's go up here and grab this grace. There should be a grace up here, I think. No, there's that. Is there a grace over here? I could have swore there was a grace like right next to this thing. Hmm. Well. Let's grab the map piece anyway. Alright. Just before I continue. Oh, there it is. I see it now. I knew there was one over here. Got that activated. Now, obviously, this thing takes forever to kill, and I'm not going to, you know, force anyone to have to sit through watching that, so I'll probably definitely make some edits to this video. Grab that. Golden runes are always good to pick up, even later on. 
I mean, you find those suckers everywhere. They pile up, you know, 200 a pop. Let's make our way past all these. I also may try to get the moon veil in this episode. I don't know if I'm strong enough. For you all, this is going to be a very quick killing. For me, I'm going to be here a while, so let's get to it. All right, we got three minutes to kill it. There we go. Ninety seven thousand runes. That's what I'm talking about. Let's get these levels. I was nervous there. I would have hated to pop that way too early. All right. So for the moon veil, my intelligence needs to be 23. I know my strength needs to be 12. But I definitely want my Vigor up to 25. And I could take my Endurance to 15. Or I could take my Endurance to 13 and put my Strength at 12, which would allow me to use the Moon Veil once I get it. But I think that looks pretty good because these are the stats I need to wield the Moon Veil. It's just a matter of taking down the beast now, which I don't know. I don't know if I can even beat the boss, but there we go. But yeah, that's uh, that right there's actually a really good thing to do if you're just starting the game. It takes forever to kill, but once you take it down, you get so many runes, it's ridiculous. So, all right, there's a few more things I want to go try to do. So, all right, so what we want to do. I don't think I can get the moon bill right now, but that's the cave we want to go to, I think. We're going to see if we can get through this cave. Oh, don't want to go that way. me pardon me I'll be out of your hair in just a second Yeet him off. All right. Well, that's a little more work than I wanted to have to put in to kill one of them, but. Somber stone too. I think I need one more. Smithing stone. All right, we're going to see because I 
It all depends if I can kill those two. hate you. Oh, sweet. Stone four. We'll see what this one is. Smithing Stone four. too much FP there than I wanted to. Smithing stone four, that's not bad. The good thing is this tunnel's not very long. So. Now I know what's over here. I just, I don't think I'm ready to deal with the, uh, the enemy that's in here. Yeah, we ain't about that. We'll we'll deal with that later. I don't want to forget anything though. That's my own fault. I could have used magic from the top and took that out. Ah. All right. All right. So let's try this again. Nice. How you like that?
Okay. Don't want to forget that. All right, let's see here. I think we're at the boss. Yep, that's the boss, so that's where we get Moonvale. But more importantly, we have a shortcut to this Grace and Alexander. Oh, the esteemed warrior. Where did you spring from? This was supposed to be a dead end, I'm sure of it. What's going on here? A door from thin air. Well, stranger things happen at sea, or so I'm told. But onward to the Kalid Wilds. Gosh, that dead end had me rather stumped. <laughs> It's time I set off to the festival at Redmain Castle. It's exhausted dialogue. The edge of the scarlet rot blighted Kaelid Wilds. Doesn't the thought just set your heart aflutter? It's time I set off to the festival. Doesn't the... Okay. So let's grab this. Another smithing stone four. Let's rest. What do I need to level up? Oh, I still need 4,000, okay. All right, so let's level up and we'll give the boss a shot. I don't know, we're gonna get my endurance to 15. Let's see here, can I wear any heavier stuff? Probably can't put a, yeah, no, no helmet, but I do have this, so. All right. Only 162 runes, so we're not, oh, here it is. We will definitely be summoning from this. Is not a lot of damage. Probably not gonna work. I mean, I know it ain't gonna work. Well, I will say that even though I'm not,
Well, I could probably get it done. All right. See if by some miracle we can take this dude down. I think I can do it though. If I could dodge those. It ain't letting me dodge nothing. closer that time. I'm going to reallocate some flasks here, give myself a few more shots with the magic. Let's try three. We'll just try to stay away from them. And then, because I dealt some decent damage just attacking on them there at the end. I just got caught by some stuff, so... Yeah, let's give this a shot. Well, this is, hasn't been a good effort. Okay. That was a very poor attempt. Could go get the talisman from EG that lowers the FP cost of spells, but... Might it might might do it, I don't know. two of those on them. So we got them to about half. You got me there. I got hit by that. All right, I think we did it. Nice. Good deal. Got the moon veil, got the drag, got a dragon heart. 
that's what it was. I was summoning in the beginning, which was taking up FP, which was only allowing me to get off like two of those rock slings. So yeah, good deal. Got the moon veil. We're gonna see if I can upgrade it. Let's see how many runes we got. 7,500. So, let's just equip this in a Now, if we go to stats, AR. See, the Moon Veil is already stronger. The AR for the Twin Blade is 180. The AR for the Moon Veil is 193. It is already stronger than the Twin Blade, and it's not even upgraded. And the Twin Blade's plus five. So, good deal. All right, let's go see if we can... It's uh... leveled up. All right, so let's take it to plus two. Well, let's take it to plus two. So it's AR is 256, okay. Good deal. All right guys, I was editing that last video and it started running a little long, so I'm gonna do the outro right here. But just to update you, I did do a little bit of farming after we upgraded the Moon Veil. I still had like 6,600 runes, so I went back, got another level out of it, put it in at endurance. I think my target on endurance is going to be around 18. Um, but then I kept going a little bit, so we got an extra 3,000 here, and we are going to buy this memory stone. So now we can equip four magic spells. Um, but that is about it. I appreciate everybody that watches when we pick up again we'll probably be back in stormville i might finish up a few things in there and then take down godrick so yeah stay tuned everybody i'll catch y'all next time later